Hi folks and welcome to my lesson on double stops, otherwise known as diets. And these double stops can really make your playing sound a lot more interesting because it's just like adding an extra harmony note to your melody that you're playing. So let's take a very simple tune like Happy Birthday and we'll apply double stops to it. Now, before we start, where do we find these double stops? Well, they are fragments of the chords built from the major scale. Now, if we're in the key of C, that major scale Double stops formed from the diatonic chords of the, the major scale. So if I wanted to play a tune like Happy Birthday, there's your melody. Let's apply the double stops. There's our first, there's our melody note. So we'll, we'll use this double stop. play this one but it's, it's got that A there that doesn't sound very good so I might just play a little triad the C major triad C G and E and that's what I do I blend the a few triads with the double stops just to resolve the notes so let's try again using major and minor thirds for our double stops. Uh, another double stop you can use are the sixths, major and minor sixths. They're also very popular with pop music and rock. Here's one of your old rock and roll favorites, friend. Shuffle on down the road. Try that now. If I'm in C, here, the sixth note is an A. So there's my double stop, and uh, a minor sixth double stop would be this. So let's try and find our melody there using the six double stops. There we have. 
have it. So your, your double stops really give you a lot more richness uh, when you're playing a melody. Now the, un the other double stops that we use are fourths. Now fourth, here is an E, and the fourth note above that is an A. And you've all heard that double stop before. Chuck Berry. That's the famous fourth double stop from rock and roll. And here's another example uh, from David Bowie. Now, next, I wanted to talk to you about fifths. They are very useful in rock and roll, especially for rhythm. You've all heard this sound. That's using your fifth double stops uh, on the two bottom strings, fifth and fourth strings. So, if I'm playing in the key of A, that would be my double stop. Key of B, here's my double stop. Now we can't really play Happy Birthday with fifth double stops. <laughs> it wouldn't sound very good. So here's an example of uh, a pop song using these fifth double stops. Think you got a pretty face, but the rest of you is out of place. You look tall. have a look at the octave double stops. An octave is just, there's my C, and there's the next C above that. So that's an octave double stop. And I just use these, my index and my pinky. Some people use their ring finger. So let's try and play our birthday song. just using the octaves. In summary, we can use double stops to enhance our chord melody playing. And in particular, we use the, the major and minor thirds, major and minor sixths, and occasionally octaves. We wouldn't use fourths to play a melody like Happy Birthday. Doesn't sound very good, but it sounds good on uh, David Bowie's China Girl, for example, or Chuck Berry's uh, Johnny Be Good. And we wouldn't use fifths, probably, to play Happy Birthday. Wouldn't sound very good. So that's uh, how you can use double stops in your playing. See you next time.